Hey, what's up everyone? It's mp4podcast.com and today we're taking a look at Street Fighter 4 Volt. Um, a few extra um, features have been added into this uh, version of Street Fighter 4 for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. Um, one thing I just want to say, <coughs> excuse me, I bought this game for 99 cents, I believe it was on Friday, and it's going up to a dollar until it hits uh, the regular price, which I think is $6.99. So if you want, just get it, because the next day it will be more money. The first time I stopped playing it, I, I immediately stopped getting new challenger, new challenger. Those were other people playing online. Uh, right now I'm not getting that, so I really, the online is confusing on this. It, like, I don't know if they do it on a certain day or however it works, but I'll just show it, start it up. Here we have, um, let me just roll this. So we have arcade, and I'll just go. Our survival is fight until your health is uh, depleted. Uh, battle against the clock to defeat seven opponents in the shortest possible time. Uh, customize, send your avatar on a training journey. I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, face off against a CPU opponent. Um, this free train. Um, Training room, get your feel on the controls, challenge, practice your combos, and blah blah blah. And then go into arcade, and it's going to show you all the different players. Now, in this, <coughs> there's a lot of lot of new players that are in this one that aren't in the other screen for the for iPhone 4. Here we have Ryu, Ken, Cami, Honda. Chung Lee, DJ, Blanca, Zangief, Sea Viper, we have Guile, Dalsam, Abel, Abel or whatever you pronounce it, uh, Bullrock, um, Bullrock, I guess, Bullrock I think it is, uh, Vega, Cody, Sagat in M. Bison, and then you get to skip the one where it randomly picks who you want to play. It'll just randomly pick someone. So we'll play a little while you. Turn this up just a little bit. Controls are exactly the same as the other one, just as responsive. I do think the AI is a um, little bit better than the other Street Fighter 4 that came out for iPhone. That was just regular Street Fighter. And when I was playing this on Friday, I would constantly gain these pop-ups saying new challenger, new challenger. Right now, it's not really happening. It would happen within the first round, really. And here we go. Now, I don't know why I'm not getting these pop-ups now for online play. But I will say this. Let me just close this for a second. The online play, when I was playing it, the game on Friday, it was a lot of lag. So maybe they're fixing it. Maybe they took the servers off. And there's possibly going to be a uh, an update to this game. I'm hoping for that. However, I would prefer to have an option 
to say I want to play online just like when you play on Xbox or PS3 or Nintendo Wii or, or any other console it doesn't matter um, but you know let's say they fix the servers and they fix the lags and you're still getting bugged if you have an, uh, a jailbroken iPod or iPhone or whatever it is you can install um, I think it's called uh, SB, SB themes you just go like that boom my Wi-Fi is now turned off I can no longer be bothered by um, anything um, that's going to try and contact this device now um, maybe you don't have a jailbroken iPhone well no problem all you have to do is go into here into settings Wait, now this is kind of a little bit more of a pain because there's more steps and um, let me just go right here and find that game again and here's my Street Fighter now I turn the Wi-Fi back on so you know maybe I'll get bothered maybe I won't but I'm going to show you a little bit more gameplay just to give you a little bit more of an idea I think the game is kind of worth it for the price especially of it's now being on sale and the game will probably go on sale a few times within the year most of the time they drop them down to 99 cents graphics are pretty much the same it's just bring, like new players that weren't in the previous version The joystick is exactly the same as before as the other one. Absolutely zero difference. I am done. <coughs> Ah, uh, here it comes. I block it. And there it is. I would say you pretty much, you pretty much for, for this version of Street Fighter. Let me just see. This stops right here. You can save your fights and replay them. So if I want to like just replay it and just show you guys, I can just come like this with my camcorder and just play it again. The exact same fight. But I would say pretty much if you're going to buy this version of Street Fighter, you're buying it for two main reasons. You're buying it for the extra characters that are not in the other Street Fighter in the online. Now I don't know why the online's not working right now. It was working on Friday. 
but whatever. It was laggy. It was kind of playable, but it was kind of buggy. Right now, from what I've heard, the best online version of Street Fighter on a portable is probably the Nintendo uh, 3DS. If there, you know, I don't know if there's an online version on PSP or something like that, but it's a good game. You know, I would say this: if you if you don't want to pay the full price, it'll probably go back on sale for Comic Con for a couple of days. It'll probably go on sale for the back to school specials, uh, Christmas. Pretty much iPhone games, all almost all of them now go on sale for 99 cents. Even for the make believe holidays, like you know Comic Con, uh, back to school, uh, Halloween. You know, New York Comic Con, E3, you pretty much name it. There's a reason to put it on sale so to get you to buy stuff. So anyway, guys, this is MP4Podcast.com signing out. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, click that subscribe button right over there. Love to have you as a subscriber. A subscriber. You guys want to help me get a, a iPad 2? There's a link in the description box. If you guys can sign up for uh, Gamefly and Netflix, I would really, really appreciate it. And anybody who helps me out, I'll return the favor by helping you you, got, you guys get a free iPad as well. So check out that link in the description box. I'll replace your own link with my link. Take care, guys. Later, bye.